Today on TFG TV, we're going to be making sourdough scones with Liv. Hi. Liv is my longest standing flower girl employee at the current. Okay, what are we making? Okay, so today we are going to be making cheddar jalapeno scones from scratch using our sourdough discard. And since we use the same exact base recipe for our savory scones and our sweet scones, I'm going to show you how you can make white chocolate raspberry scones from the same exact recipe. So we're going to start off with flour, baking powder, salt, and then sugar into the mix. And then in a separate bowl, we are going to put our wet mixture, which consists of our buttermilk, our sourdough starter, or discard, and then our eggs. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to take 252 grams of cold chopped butter, and you're going to put it into your blender, your fruit processor, and then you're going to want to take your dry mix, and you're just going to want to take a couple scoops till it completely covers your butter mix. Keep adding some flour. Check that your butter has broken down into pea-sized pieces and add the flour and butter mixture back into your bowl. Then we're gonna add your wet mix into the dry mix and at this point you can go either sweet or savory or you can split it and do both. For our sweet scone, I'm adding white chocolate chips and frozen raspberries. We use frozen so that they don't get too mushy while we're mixing them. For our savory scone, I'm adding fresh chopped jalapenos and shredded cheddar cheese. When they're all mixed, we roll up the dough so it's about an inch thick and we use a pastry cutter to punch out the scone. Once they're punched, we lay the scones on a sheet pan and freeze them at least overnight. Then, when they're ready to bake them in the morning, we just pop them out of the freezer, dress them up for the oven, and bake at 350 for approximately 30 to 35 minutes. And voila! Delicious fresh sourdough scones! <laughs> <laughs> really good. That was really good. I like the jalapenos.